Hello everybody and welcome back to more Crusader Kings 2, the old gods with me, Orin. Uh, last time on Crusader Kings 2, the old gods with me, Orin, a uh, couple of things happened. Lithuania went kinda balls to the wall and declared war on all of Scotland, which drug in England and France and other people. Uh, I got bored and declared war on not only East Anglia, I think that's the name of it. The Duchy of East Anglia. Yes, because they were in a revolt at the time, you can see East Anglia here, here, and here. Took that, decided to march straight down into Essex, the capital of England, and that's what we're in the process of. We also fiddled around a little bit with uh, Theobald and getting people to help kill his son and wife. Uh... I say getting, we actually didn't manage to kill his wife, but not his son yet. I can't seem to get his spy master to help me, which was pretty nice last time around. But, uh, oh well. We'll work on that later. Um, we can probably continue to rush here. Just go ahead and take him out. I wonder if 65 is actually good enough. It is not. Um, I guess we can siege in Essex. If it's a lot, I mean, well, I mean, let's just go kill an army. Killing armies is fun. Things are happening. Lithuania is rushing a siege up there. We can pop here, straight into here. They run away on the 13th, we run away, we get there on the 15th. Damn it. Alright. So they get out on the 26th. We get there on the 22nd. Dying. Ooh. We had a son. Sigadir. Yes. Sigadir. That was our... Uh, Sigadir was... Sigadir. Snake in the eye. Our first ruler. You know what? Genius. Oh, he's a genius. Um, I'll allow it. Sigadir sounds good. We can pretty much crush this army without, without problem. I mean, 73, we got a prisoner. Uh, enforced demands. Yes. Awesome. We can walk down here to Kent, so we can hop back right over to Evero to press this wall. Yes, I won. I have became, I have become a lot of things. Just one of them is Duke of All Essex. So we can go ahead and hand these things off, um, and then we kind of have to think about who we're going to give it to. Uh, I believe we still do not have many great family members. We're probably going to have to wait a few more years. So, as powerful as Essex is, I think we'll just give it to a noble. Um, we could start... sort of building a future king of England. We might give it to this guy. Baltolfir? Baltulfir of Cornwall. He's been good to us. He has three children. Um, son of Theon. Theon was a prick, but since the father did not pass to the son, go ahead and give him the Jarldom. Mm, probably will not be able to usurp the new. Um, still cannot usurp this as well. Okay, well. We'll go ahead and hand him the counties, then, at least a few of them. We'll give you Bedford, and... Essex. And... Sussex. No, Sussex down there. Northampton. Yes. And... Middlesex. Awesome. So he'll be our future King of England, because... I don't know if I mentioned this, but, uh... Create Wales, which he was kind of, that was kind of his thing. 
Uh, you have to be Celtic. And we're not Celtic because we're Norse. Because Norse is better. So he moved straight up. He just moved court to Durham. Uh, Nantes has been converted to the Norse religion. And England, we are at 41. So we will probably need one more big, big land grab, I think. Another four counties, so Lancaster, I think, is our only real opportunity. I think if we take Lancaster, we'll be able to usurp. Which doesn't make a whole lot of sense uh, geographically. You'd want to take duchies that are close together for a multitude of reasons, but what the hey. And the Khan of Cumania. to cause to war for an independence war. Um, I don't know why we have an alliance with this guy. It's half-brothers. I'm his half-brother's brother-in-law. So his half-brother, this guy, is married to my sister. You know what? I don't know if I want to go to war with half the world. But, uh, I guess I will. Mainly because I'm curious about their army size. I want to see it up close and personal. It's not very big. And Ruthuania is having problems with Kiev. Uh, these guys ran away. Win. I hope they don't actually think I'm gonna go help them. Because uh, I have better things to do. Go ahead and hop over here. Hop back on our boat. Um. winning by 70%, so I probably don't need to help them. Uh, he has a low marshal. And his... Asterios is... being ruled by a boy, really? It's not too bad. Not too bad at all. Um, I can't create... Alicia because I'm not Christian. Alright. Uh, I'd really like to finish off this guy's heir so I can move on to bigger and better things. Maybe him, maybe the King of England. Uh, either way, I'm probably going to have to throw money at people I don't want to throw money at. But that is life. Go ahead and start my timer now. Um. Herbert? No. Probably not. Definitely not. Already got her. His name is Joffrey, so there's no way in hell. Still very bitter about uh, the Game of Thrones series. <laughs> what do I declare war on? This? Do I go screw around in Bohemia? What do I do? How's this war coming along? Lower Lorraine versus Lothrain Junia. It's at zero right now. You have a total of 13,000. They look unformed up. Um, Duke of Lorraine. The Quarreler. Hmm. Yeah, no. I'll pass. Sure, I gained 20 prestige from this year, bitch. All of the auto saves. Wisdom, mercy, you're legendary. Goddamn right they are. Come on. If they win this battle, then that's not what I wanted. If they won that battle, then the rest of the war probably will win. 
pretty easily. Scotland would have went quietly into the night. Now they got them on Iran, but they... They can still do it. They're gonna unseat... The, they're just gonna unseat all of this. He would have to go... Try to beat them in beach timing, which I don't think he can do with 6,000. He's gonna try to take them in like defensive engagement. I don't know what I'd do in that situation. Italy has high crown. And I need to stand this boat down soon. So I need to stab my retinue in some way. Um, do we continue to take down here? Give it all the one arch priest. That might be pretty funny. Just have one giant arch priest thing going down here. Hmm. I feel like it might be too easy not to. I mean, if only it all wasn't so broken. Here's the king of Castile. Here's the Duchess of Castile. This is the Duke of Portugal, and this is the Duchess of Castile. Portugal, Asturias, I guess we'll have a shitload. Okay. Um, I guess we're gonna go drop these guys off in Holland. Just because that's kind of my new hangout. Bo. You were that thing on Scane. I'm pretty sure Scane is bigger than you. But... Um, let's go raid Luxembourg. Why not? I'm bored. They're at war with people. Probably can't pull more than 10,000 units out of their ass that quickly. I'll diplomatically explain things to people. Take one more peek at this and wish that he would help me. Ooh, 92,000. 92,000 vassals. That's a lot of vassals. Also, our retinue can be increased. Um, we can increase it. One, two, three. Three more heavy cav. And then we can increase this rent new now. How do we make this a better fighting army killing rent new? Heavy cab's a good start. More pikemen? I wish there was a pikeman heavy infantry combo. I think this two, three there. And then this is the end of this retinue. And then all retinue score from here goes straight into uh, skirmish retinue. It's only 600 retinue cap. And then we'll get a really good uh, castle seeking retinue out of that. And that'll be pretty good. But yeah, that's another... Shit, what is this? That's another 5, that's another 1500. I need another 3,000, so this one's going to be up to 13,500, I think. Um, Yiland, Jarl of Yiland, my dear sweet kinsman with three children. Ooh, it's actually not so bad. We may have to look into giving him some, uh, some of his kids some stuff. When it comes to my wife, Princess of Norway, Empress of Scandinavia. She's not the best, but for the sake of roleplay, I think. Uh, um, yeah, Stark Deer and Asbjorn were kind of mortal enemies, but I think they were also kind of friends.
Northampton. They just joined and they're already Norse. What do you know? Oh man. Grimir the first of Mecklenburg has passed away. He was with us for a long ass time too. Age sixty. Now Otter looks good though. His uh his kids are mostly spoken. Excuse me, his kids are mostly spoken for though, which is kind of a thing. Looks like we've had another engagement or two up here, but... Oh, I'm helping Lorraine. That's awesome. Piss off, Lorraine. We're gonna go kill armies. Fun. I'd go raid Lorraine. Here, Lorraine. This is how I feel about you. <laughs> Using me when I'm not paying attention. Did not drink the wine and my complicity was discovered. Damn it. Look, I'm sorry. I know I'm dishonorable and I'm an infidel. Well, from my point of view, you're the infidel. But I'll let that one pass. Here, Lorraine, suck it. How does it feel? Book without titles pushed in my hands by a hooded man clad in midnight blue. Something I said, but it was lost in the confusion. The book was still there. Um, it wants me to read it. I think some people would argue that all books wanted to be want to be read. It's kind of their whole purpose. And it looks like Lithuania lost another pretty important fight there. They still have got to be ahead in Morris for that, right? Oh, they're down to 15%. God, they've buggered this up. We have won something. Awesome. Keep up the good work, team. Why is there a British army standing here? England. What are you doing, boys? Oh, yeah, Normandy joined in on that war. Okay, yeah, no. Have fun. Go siege. Um... Hmm... Yeah, free money. <laughs> we drag someone out of the castle named Kerling. <laughs> Oh, was it his daughter? Who was it to you? Why do you care? A strange chest made of unknown metal was recovered from your men while they looted the holding. Try as they might, they haven't been able to force the chest open, and its contents remain a mystery. It has now been deposited into your care. This happened a long time ago, I thought, as well. It's okay. We're stealing Kerling women. We're gonna keep it up. We're gonna keep up the good work. Oh, we have to unpause it though to keep up the good work. Important to remember. Now we can pop over and raid Luxembourg. Come on, get there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, yep, yeah, no, I understand. Take him. Bedford? These British holdings are, uh, they're switching over real quick. See, look. Lothar and Genia, I'm doing you a favor, I promise. Luxembourg has been looted by a lot of money. Sick. Yeah, there we go, now they're on fire. Um, they're four levels only, two and a half, so it doesn't really matter how many people they have. Jarl Asbjorn. Damn, you did not live as long as I hoped. Good Jarl, nonetheless. Son Boodley, I'm sure will do just fine. Um, Asbjorn was... Oh no, they're all Obskagen. But Obskagen has been decently loyal, I think. I don't ever remember Holstein. I'm revolting. I remember Liebeck revolting a lot, but uh, they're 
like Slavic or something, I can't remember. Let's turn four level down here. Five and a half. Yeah, not the biggest fan of that either. Um I guess we'll take the Yarl of Cornwall. And uh, I also need another replacement. Dan, Nud. Ah, uh, I guess it's him. I guess it's Cornwall now. There, we've got a, a little bit of loot in on Luxembourg. We can leave now and go do something else. I just kind of pissed off whole idea, to be honest. These guys can get out of Shaylin. They can probably go down here. Make a more centralized position. It looks like uh, Lithuania has gotten their shit together a little bit. Maybe not as much as they need to. Who is Cornwall at war with? Um, just the Scotland thing, alright. So Cornwall's attempts down here are actually pretty helpful. Yep, something's broken out in Wolgast, and... Hoo hoo hoo, province, province, province. Please be under a different war. Upper Burgundy and province. Now swinging down south and taking province. I don't even know if I have a cast of spell on this. No, I have one for champagne, but I think conquest for province. This is a. Uh, it's definitely an idea. It's a good county, it's a big county. Um, Slavic historical staying power. Right in the middle of the Mediterranean, it would help give me a jumping point into other revolts if they sprung up in Italy, Italy or in Savoy or whatever. Um, I could always just go take Asturias, but it looks like they got a big army there. I don't know why. And it looks like the Abbasids have lost pretty much everything now. I don't see the Abbasid name on the map. We have the uh, Jazarazid. The Jarazid. Um, maybe this, but I don't know if that's worth it. And Upper Burgundy still is not high enough up to be of. to be of anything to me, really. I can only hope that, like, Brabrant or something will join in as well. The book is gibberish, but also enlightening. But even if I struggle with some of the chapters, of mystery still engrosses me. Something instilled in the book's language. And I'm determined to find out what. Um... Book secrets elude me. I guess I can fabric I can sow descent up here, but I don't know if that's actually going to be that helpful. If I remember right... A lot of these were count. Yeah, these are oversaw directly by the king, and these counts are tied directly to the king, and not to that duke. So I don't actually know how helpful that would be. Um, Julian's host is a caroling man who won Northumberland, which I accept fully. Um, a caroling is complaining to me. Oh boy, it took me several weeks before the mystery of the book revealed itself to me. Gibberish parts were encoded, and after many hours trying to decipher the code, I managed to break it and construct a key to make the book easy to read. I gained Mystic, which gives me one intrigue. Not that bad. I'd much rather have probably Impaler. Plus one Marshall's nice. Um, Gardener's okay, Stewardship's always good, but if they want to give me Intrigue, uh, I don't mind. You take my 50 gold. Take my outrageous amount of money. Join me. Hmm. 
peace be with you, an intriguing theme. Yes, it is. No, I will not declare war on Genoa. I do not give a shit about Genoa. Who are you? Rodbard host. And what do you want? Algier. Okay. Um, my current spear is 21, this guy's 22, that'd be fine. Earth and Peace, Archpriest, whatever your name is. I don't really care that much about my spear, but, yeah, whatever. I'm sure he's fine, right? Yeah, he's fine. I didn't hurt his feelings that bad. Alright, Jimmy, I got done with one revolt. What's his power like right now? 12,000. Hmm. I may... His armies are definitely split, though. I may be able to declare war on him and just siege these places out before he even has a chance to react. Looks like Lithuania has re-raised his levies and went back. So that'll be interesting. We're gonna let our, uh retinue build back up before anything happens though. Population of Zealand has now converted to the Norse faith. Cool. Yeah, I can't imagine it's gonna take long to rush through these. They've been captured and recaptured so many times. Munsterian prepared invasion of Scotland. Jesus. Everybody wants Scotland. <laughs> Everybody pre is preparing an I even prepared an invasion against Scotland. That was a long time ago, but there was a Denmark prepared invasion against Scotland. If I remember correctly. Um, <clears throat> oh, excuse me? Hold on. Raiders under Chiefs Cahe of Sam. Yeah, you guys, where are you from? Really? Your dick is that big. Do you know who I am? <laughs> oh, perm. If I could grade Holy War right now, I would grade Holy War for perm just because that guy messed up. That's gonna be on my list of things to do. After I get Great Holy War, you know, we might lean on uh, England first, or maybe France, but Perm, you'll, you'll get yours. You will get yours. It's the last thing I do. Still very disappointed in this plot. Like, and that's my timer done, and that will be the, this episode done. She hates me far too much. He and so does he and so does he. Awesome. You guys are the best. 13, 500. Need like one more tick. When this turns like November, I sh it should be there. Or you'll gain 41. That'll work too. Uh, Duke Richard III has hired someone to kill my target. Awesome, Duke Richard III. Hop to it. Kill him. Yep, kill his son. Go past this scumbag. And then we can kill him. <laughs> That'll be great. Failure! Damn it. At least it's clueless as to who to blame for this. Um, Duke of Gallery. Our truce is expiring with him. Holy War for Lothian. On the King of England. On Cedric, the King of England. <laughs> oh, Cedric, I didn't even realize it was you. When I say Cedric, of course I mean Thurdick. Because his name's weird. Um. Summerland is three, and there's already a war going for that. Lothian, there's already a war going for that. York, don't. Is three. Weiss is three. Mercia is two currently. 
so yeah, we go for Lancaster, and we go hard for Lancaster. Guys together and get you walking. Um, that's closer. Um, they may be the only one ships we have in uh, one vast. Well, I never mind. I take that back. I guarantee Norway has enough ship. Norway has a fleet. Christ sakes. Has inherited the barony of Stravalot. Oh. That's very sad. Um, well. Great, great new baron, I guess. Still can't usurp this because he's at war. I still can't usurp this because he's at war. Or, well, this. Um. Invasion of Scotland by Lithuania is at 11. Invasion of Scotland by Moonster is at 14. Alright, yep. It is the year 1000. Look at that. We have come quite a ways. We've got an auto balance this unit. Um, which is lying about being perfectly balanced. Just false numbers of things, but uh, yeah, sure. the game thinks it's auto balanced. Who am I to say? Swing over here into the Gulf, and uh, in the episode, right? Damn it! I want to kill England. I want to make the Kingdom of England in this game, or tonight. Um, I guess I can do that tomorrow. Hmm, what do I want to do? Oh, what did I do this episode? <laughs> Everybody wants Scotland. Literally everybody wants Scotland. Um, yeah. That'll be the end of this episode. Uh, thank you guys as always for watching. It's been great. Super appreciative of it. You're the best. Um, yeah. I guess I'll record one more tonight, even though it is 3.30 in the morning and I want to go to bed. Um, yeah, I'll record one more. Why not? Kill England. So yeah. See you guys next time.